Yes, we're home free. No need for thanks. I'd rather get paid. Hmm? You're getting paid right now. Hmm? Huh? Oh. Forget about the Turks. Ah. Could come at us any time. Keep an eye out. I think this means another war is coming. What are they watching? Uh, hey! They're working for Wu Tai, isn't it obvious? There's still a lot of smoke rising using from the spies so they don't have to break the ceasefire. While and other debris continue Tell to hinder rescue those efforts, the fire appears to, to have another been war. mostly extinguished. So if we help catch the bombers, uh, we get a reward there. or something? Uh, that's the director of Shinra's <laughs> Advanced Weaponry Division, hey, isn't it? Hey, enough uh, of that excuse doom and gloom. But would you mind answering a few questions? They're targeting reactors. Can you give us any updates on the status of the reactor? What kind so of damage the did it suffer in the explosion? Are we in any danger? <sighs> Mako Reactor 5 has been temporarily shut down and all fires have been successfully extinguished. The situation is under control and the people of our fair city need not worry about any additional complications. We're in the process of conducting a full forensic investigation, but we suspect the device used was similar to that employed in the attack on Mako Reactor 1. The perpetrators of that atrocity were filmed making their escape. These agents of the eco-terrorist group Avalanche are currently believed to be in hiding somewhere in Midgar. And uh, given that this group has now attacked two reactors in quick succession, can they really be stopped before they strike again? What do you think? Uh, well, uh... <laughs> Have no fear. Shinra will keep Midgar safe. Okay, time's up! Alright, let's go. Why the hell would anyone do that? <laughs> Those avalanche guys are unbelievable! Let's kill them. Man, I can't decide where to oh, go Oh, what timing! Mind lending me a hand? Place is really hopping, huh? Nice side effect of the train situation. So, what do you say? I'd love to, but... I help out every now and then. It's fun. Eris! Well, well. What are you doing all the way up there? Was trying to get a look at the reactor. Who's this guy? This is Cloud. He's a mercenary. And currently my bodyguard. That's Oats. See you. Two peas in a pod. What are you guys up to? We all went to see the reactor. Oh, that's right. You're supposed to come by the house. Uh, what for? I don't know. You're just supposed to. Well, guess we have a new destination. I should probably explain. The Leaf House is the local orphanage. That's where all these kids live. Hey, Aerith, where'd you go? The church again? Next time, we should all go together. Why, hello, Aerith. As popular as ever, I see. Apparently, but they sure keep me on my toes. <laughs> uh, better than being bedridden. Thanks again for all those herbs. You've helped a lot of people. No problem. Anytime. How'd you manage to find so many anyway? <laughs> oh, I have my ways. And him? He's my bodyguard, just until I get home. And you're sure he's up to it? 
Hmm. Maybe. Since I'm so generous, I gather medicinal herbs for his patients sometimes. Here's I'm the leaf pass. So I can read it. I'll bring some to your place, Eric. There you are. We're back, and we brought Aerith with us. Sorry to make you come out here. Don't be. It's on my way home. Well then, I hope you won't mind me asking for some flowers. No problem. How many? All you can carry. What with all the doom and gloom we've been hearing on the news recently, I thought some flowers might help cheer everyone up. I'm sure they will, and I'd love to help. Let's all wash up before our meal. Please grow big and yummy. So, Cloud, what's your favorite flower? They're all the same to me. Huh. You sure you want to say that to a florist? Better than lying. Okay. Then what'd you do with the flower I gave you? I, uh... You give it away? I did. Ooh, to who? Tell me. Don't recall. Hmm? What? Thought you didn't like lying. <sighs> well, anyway. My house is just up this path. Mom should be home by now, so I'll introduce you. There you go. That's my house. It's amazing. <laughs> Up to no good? Rude came by. So, this is my mom, Elmira. And this is Cloud, my bodyguard. Uh, hi. Take good care of her? That's my job. <laughs> or was my job. Yep, thanks. So, Cloud, you gonna head back to Sector 7? Yeah. Then I'll show you the way. <laughs> Then why'd you have me bring you here? What if the Turks show up again? It'd suck, but I've dealt with them before. Honestly, I'm much more worried about you. What if you get lost, huh? You'd be too embarrassed to admit it, and so you'd just keep on going. Quit acting like you know me. Hey, Mom. I'm gonna go take Cloud over to Sector 7, okay? <sighs> okay. But why not wait until tomorrow? If you head out now, it'll be dark when you get back. Better to rest up here and make the trip first thing in the morning. When you'll have daylight to spare. That's true. She's got a point, Cloud. Hold up. Oh, yeah. I still need to deliver some flowers to the Leaf House. Since we have a little time before dinner, you should come with. That wasn't the deal. You mean you want more? Even though you've got a priceless reward coming your way, do you know what I promised him? I'll do it. <laughs> <sighs> I'll go grab the baskets. Be right back. <sighs> that Aerith. She's a handful, isn't she? It must be tough. No, never mind. Hmm. 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 Hmm? 
you take this one? Huh? Um. Take it. Uh. Hmm. Right. Off we go. <sighs> and these right here are my babies. Do you think we should pick? Any of them. Oh, don't be like that. I know you have an eye for this kind of thing. That's the one I gave you. Huh, it is? Nice try, mister. You can't fool me. I think we still need a few more. Which should we pick next? She said, as many as you can carry, so maybe a few more? Good eye. People used to give these to declare their loyalty to one another. Interesting, right? I think we're good now. What do you say? Shall we go? No need to hurry. We're not under the gun or anything. I'm not cut out for this crap. Sure you are. And when you're done, you'll be drowning in job offers. So, how do you think they'll arrange these flowers? Don't know. Well, we'll soon find out. I'll wait out here. Oh, okay. But I might be a while. Why not check out the town? Still at it. She couldn't have finished yet.
This here's the Sector 5 Community Center. Damn, I hate waiting. Hey, mister, do you want one of these? Couldn't have finished yet. Damn, I hate waiting. I understand you must be busy, but I hope you haven't forgotten about my research. Cloud, I have come up with the most fascinating theory. Perhaps you can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it? Cloud, I have the most amazing news. I believe I might know how to develop summoning materia, something heretofore thought impossible. Scientists say that this materia can only be found in nature, but I may just be able to prove otherwise. And so, Cloud, I turn to you. I would like to test this theory by way of my combat simulator. To wit, I want you to fight and defeat summon data in VR. I sense that you find my phrasing to be somewhat obtuse. Let me know when you have made your preparations. Okay. Oh, hey. You might 
planning this puppy up. Not about swapping it out for a brand new one. Maybe big value on the trade. She couldn't have finished yet. help thus far I've done it I've developed a new materia then I invite you to ready your portable battle simulator Nothing to it. 
Outstanding. The Shiva summoning materia is complete. And now it's yours. Use it as you see fit. The Lady of Frost is the perfect companion for a man like you, Cloud. She will prove most useful when the time comes to destroy Shinra. I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. That's what's called easy. Continue to help me gather vital information from my research. I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. Way ahead. You won't stop telling us stories about that. Can't leave without telling. Probably head back. Is something wrong? You could say that. Sounds like someone spooked the kids. Yeah. Two of them disappeared. They ran away after this creepy guy wearing black clothes showed up. A Turk? That's what I thought, but no. It's this guy who's always stumbling around town in a dirty robe full of holes. They say he's sick or something. Oh, and he had some kind of number tattooed on his arm. I don't like the sound of this. I'm gonna check it out. I know someone who fits that description. I'll come with. Okay. Come on. I know this place is off limits to grown-ups, but if we want to rescue them, well, we gotta break the rules. Oats! You're back! Aerith's come to help. Yeah, leave it to us. We'll take care of it from here. But there are monsters out there! Don't worry. I've brought a super strong friend along with me. I used to be a soldier. So where's the guy? I don't know. He disappeared and we can't find him. Right now, let's worry about the kids. Come on. You guys have got to hurry and find They ran off this way. Be careful. Who knows? They're kids. Nothing to do but look all over. I just hope we find them in time. Easy. Are. 
they're not alone. You sure? <laughs> this to me. Soldier. He was? Did you go fight in the war? I might have. Get back. I can fight too, you know. You're mine. That's that. Cut that 
I'm gonna grow up to be a soldier like you. You can't just grow up to be a soldier. You gotta work at it. Cloud thinks I'm good enough to be one, right? Look at you, Mr. Popular. That was so cool, you guys. Especially that, oh, yeah! Yeah, it was really cool when you went like, yeah, yeah! You've got it all wrong. Like that. No way. It was way faster than that. Yeah, yeah, like that. Fine. Then how about... Yeah? Yeah. Like that. Isn't that right, Cloud? Isn't that right, Cloud? Tifa? What's wrong? Nothing. Is Tifa like your girlfriend? No. Hmm, but she's someone special. It's not like that. More like... I don't know how to explain. I see. Thank you. From now on, if you run into trouble, promise me you'll find an adult, okay? Okay, I will. And here, since you're so cool, you guys are both grown-ups, but you're also one of us now. You can come and play here whenever you want. Similar. Huh? There's the number, but why two? Who knows? Come to think. The reunion. Sephiroth is. Do you? Sephiroth, the war hero? I know he died in an accident five years ago. They said so on the news. Maybe they did. But I've got a feeling he's still alive. Oh, right. <sighs> Come on, let's go. Then you must be from the legendary. The legendary. Hey, Cloud! I know a lot of people around here need help. When I'm out on patrol, a lot of them tell me about their problems. Do you think you might be interested in helping out? Well, I'm all for it. We still have plenty of time. I'm on the clock. Don't worry, I give you permission. I always have the latest information. Come find me if you want to know. Lovely, don't you think? Great job. That's wonderful. <sighs> Isn't it? Oh, I nearly forgot. 
I saw some Shinra suit walking toward your house a little while ago. He was dressed all in black. A little scary looking. Hello, Aerith. What do you want? Haven't seen him before. He your new boy toy? He's my bodyguard, if you must know. Wait a minute. Those eyes. Is he the one who beat up Reno? And what if I am? Need to cross my T's, dot my I's, that's all. Cloud, leave him be. Rude's not a bad person, really. No, I'm not bad. But like it or not, I sometimes have to do bad things. <sighs> Don't take it personal. You Turks are all the same. All bark, no bite. You're one to talk. No need to get rough! Stay back. Time to burn. You're done. Take him down. I'll take care of this. Just a bit. <laughs> Keep up the pressure, Watch okay? This. You gotta get a little payback. Ah! One Come more on. shot. Mm. Okay. <laughs> so, you had enough yet? No. I don't believe that I have. That's it! Here it comes! Stop it! Can't. It's my job. Then think about changing careers. So it's my turn? Stop it! I'm just so tired. My turn. Okay. How's that payback I'm working out for you? Oh. Better than expected. Any last words? Shit! I thought you didn't want to get rough. No, but this is self-defense. So long. Deal with that. I'll take care of them. Need more magic. Get him! <laughs> I can't do that. <clears throat> hey there, partner. I'm sure you're having the time of your life, but we're needed on standby for a job at something about Sector 7. 
So get your ass back here now. <sighs> Understood. Got somewhere else to be? Apparently so. Go home and stay there. You know I can't do that. Huh? You're heading in already? Yeah, that's enough for one day. Where have you two been? Uh, I've been worried sick. Sorry, we got a little sidetracked. Dinner's ready, in case you're wondering. Ah, great. But before we sit down, I want you to make up the guest room. Gotcha. Take a load off, okay? Judging by those eyes, I'm guessing you're a soldier. Ex-soldier. I hate to ask. But would you leave tonight without any fuss, no questions? You boys made a trade, a normal life, for power. You can't have it both ways. I'm back! Good! Now, I hope you're hungry. Starving, right? I've never been so proud. The man you've become? Women must be hounding you day and night. Not really. You know, there's all kinds of temptations in the big city. I'd feel a lot better if I knew you'd found a good girl. One who'd make sure you didn't get into trouble. I can take care of myself. An older, more mature girl. I could keep you on the straight and narrow and tell you when you're being a silly goose. That's the perfect type for you, I'd say. <clears throat> Don't want to overstay my welcome. What are you doing? Uh, uh, nothing. Did you have a bad dream? Don't worry, you'll feel much better in the morning. And I promise to take you straight home. Uh, okay. <sighs> Please don't let her hear me again.
You're leaving? So, how do I get to Sector 7? It's simple enough. Just cut through Sector 6. It isn't exactly safe, but you should be okay, seeing as you're a soldier. Was one. Promise me, you'll never talk to Aerith again. Please. You got it. Thank you. Talk about a coincidence. What are you doing here? Waiting. Why? Because I'm not sick of you yet. <sighs> <laughs> Lead on then. With pleasure. <laughs> nothing. You can see the sky. They're still working on the new plate. I don't like this part of Midgar. Back when they were still building Midgar, there was an accident and the plate fell. People had only just started moving in, so there weren't a lot living there at the time, but... And that's? The underside of Sector 6, Wall Market. A real special place. But I'm sure you already knew that, right? I didn't tell you? I enlisted pretty much right after I left home. Don't know much about this place, or any of the slums. Well, it took a lot of people to build Midgar, and they all needed to blow off steam. So some traders built an entertainment district. Inns, shops, bars, the works. Folks started pouring in from all over. Business was booming, money was flowing, which attracted the attention of some guys who didn't much care for the law. Now there isn't any. Right. But instead of trying to solve the problem, the government decided to just wall it in. And that's how Wall Market began. Out of sight, out of mind, as the old saying goes. For the folks in charge, there's no better way to deal with it. So it's like a giant veil. Yeah. Wanna see what's behind it? Not really. That's good. Because uh -huh. I know a better way to get to Sector 7. One that, tragically, doesn't go through Wall Market. And it's just through this tunnel here. At least it was, back when I was a kid.
It's been like this, you know, ever since the plate fell. And there's no other way? It'll be an adventure. <laughs> You're mine. You're dead. That. A big arm. Kind of cute, don't you think? Uh... Oh, great. Someone's pulled up the ladder. <sighs> I wonder if we can use this. Idea. I'll hop on and you give me a ride. You serious? Absolutely. I'll throw down the ladder for you to climb up after. What did I tell ya? You did it! Yeah. <laughs> uh... Hmm? Alright, good enough. Let's keep on trucking. Hmm. Stop! Did we wake it up? I 
wonder if someone blocked it off because of all the monsters that kept showing up. Pretty dangerous place for kids to play. Raised in the slums, remember? You're tough. Hmm, that's supposed to be a compliment? <laughs>